I've yeah. never been to Florida. What? Wow. I, in Florida. And I thought, continuing to look like paradise to me. Yeah. On TV, it looks like Evan. And we're into another new hour. Insensitivity training for a politically correct world. It's a pre Friday, Thursday morning. It's the 9th of May, 2024. I'm Woody. That's Raving. Hello. It's uh, Greg Goring. Yeah, hi. Menace. Hello to you. Good morning, Woody. Seabass. Sammy. Oh, yeah. Good morning. Oh, yeah, I like that. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I got the uh, phones open. 877 Woody. You can uh, hit me up with a text. Over to 22987. We'll go uh, zero to political. The game. We right. are not going to go zero no. to political. Yeah. Uh, we'll see. Um, <laughs> well, we have to try to guess how they took a political, so I guess we have to put our our thinking caps on for that one, right? Yeah. Uh, but Robert F. Kennedy Jr. <laughs> oh, Lord. Once had a worm in his head Oof. that ate part of his brain, and then the worm died. He says that uh, he picked it up during one of his environmental trips to Africa, South America, or Asia. Not sure exactly which one, but uh, you might want to know, how do we know all this? Because wow. it came up during a deposition that he gave during his divorce from his second wife. And he was trying to pay her as little as possible, so he listed some cognitive issues that had uh, diminished his earning power oh, okay. at the time. Mm-hmm. One of them, what the tie-in was. <laughs> one of them was the worm. Yeah, you might have something to do with that. He was experiencing uh, severe memory loss, mental fog, so he consulted with a neurologist. Uh, But that was a long time ago, and you might be saying to yourself, well, then why should I vote for you for president? Mm -hmm. But he says now he's in, quote, robust physical and mental health. In fact, RFK Jr. posted on social media saying, quote, I offered to eat five more brain worms and still beat President Trump and President Biden in a debate. I feel confident of the result, even with a six worm handicap. <laughs> wow. Worms. He sounds like he's on the brink of death. Uh, he does. Yeah. It doesn't sound good. His voice, his so voice I couldn't sit through a debate. And what, just and, can't. And what happened to his voice again? Like, why is it like that? Spasmoidic something or other with his. Th- what is it? It's called uh, like spasmoidic some nervous. Uh, it's because yeah. he's spasmoidic. <laughs> yeah, it's very uncomfortable. It makes your can't throat even. hurt. It, yeah. does. it does. Just listening to it. Can't even hear brutal. it. Yeah. Ugh. Uh, zero to political. This game, uh, we've been playing it for years just because we go through so many news stories and I love the comment section. It's always fun. Well, most of the time it's, it's fun. frustrating. Mm-hmm. Just to watch people get crazy. But you can have something so innocuous. Seabass found this one. This is always the example that we use about the uh, the soup recipe. It was like a Martha Stewart pumpkin whatever soup recipe for Delicious fall. fall soup. Mm-hmm. Yeah, fall soup. And like it was two, two comments in. Somehow someone made it political. <laughs> And so uh, we made a little game out of it because people could take anything. Oh, you don't like the weather? It's whatever, you know, it's the other, other side's fault. You're a Democrat, yeah. the Republican's fault. You're a Republican, mm-hmm. the Democrat's fault. Your team lost, same thing. Mm-hmm. Trump's fault. Oh, Biden's yeah. fault. Yep. Somehow tie it in. Somehow bring up politics so one-dimensional because that's how you see everything, even a soup recipe. And so the game is, Seabass has one of these uh, types of articles, like something that he found online where it's completely innocuous, nothing to do with politics whatsoever and then how many comments did we have to go deep to find the first one that made it political zero to political and uh, what's the first one here Seabass? Greg this mm-hmm. is uh, I, if you were in charge this would be what you would be doing okay there's a new law which makes releasing balloons in public illegal I'm the author of that bill <laughs> <laughs> uh, should be You're Greg wrote going. it I'm not a big fan of making new laws but that should be against the law because it is littering because people littering. think well if it goes in the sky it, it, it burns off it, yeah it burns off it goes to heaven now okay how many <laughs> here's the here's, I'll, I'll give you this here's the twist okay. all right it's in Florida Mm. Oh, okay. okay. That's so bizarre. Does the commenting get political in more or less than two comments? Ooh. Ooh Obviously, wow. less I, being one. Sure, <laughs> right? sure. I say but, but three more. Above, more, okay. Because I don't think they're that environmentally crazy in Florida, but it is the internet, so it could be something from it's outside Florida. Of Florida. I'm going to say it's the first one. I'm going to say number <laughs> one is political. Yeah. I agree. I'm just trying to think of how they would oh, tie how? it in. They'll say, let's attach DeSantis to some balloons. Oh, uh, yeah. Let him float. Uh, uh, that's what they'll say. China or something. Somebody. <laughs> oh, that's, you know what? I mean, you know the answer, but uh, that would have been a good guess. Some, mm. what are those Chinese balloons? Uh, <laughs> you know, the government right. someone's gone to do something about Mar- Mar-a-Lago, Mar-a-Lago floating away. Uh, right. Maybe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. So, uh, Reagan, well, what like, maybe say? like some Floridians actually mad about it. Like, when did we become all these, like, 
hippies. You've right. been to Florida, right? Yeah, true. Yeah. And so, like, they don't like this. They think that this is, you know, yeah. infringing on their rights. Yeah. To release yeah. balloons. To litter. Yeah. And kill wildlife. But there's, but there's a lot of people. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I think there's more like ocean-minded people. It's like that I whole. Would think. Yeah, usually people who Have live. Have you been to Florida? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have not. No. Greg, you've actually never they, been to Florida. I've yeah. never been to Florida. What? Wow. I just uh, Rules. recently watched. They're maniacs in Florida. A show Love based it. in Florida, and I thought, continuing to look like paradise to me. Yeah. On TV, it looks like heaven. There Certain are, parts, yes. There are a lot of nice, nice areas. All right, yeah. Well, how, how many comments? Number one. Yeah. Number one. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> and how they make it political. All right. That is absolutely disgusting. What do Republicans have to do trying to protect the environment? Okay. What? Oh, or what's up? Pardon me. What right do Republicans have? See, I nailed it. Trying to I'll protect take the environment. An All right. I apologize. Yeah. So that comes from the left. See the right there? Yeah. yeah. I apologize. All right. Thank you. All right, so uh, Ravy nailed it on that See, one. I've nice. spent so many, so much time at Whitey's Fish Camp in yeah. Jacksonville, Florida. Shout out to Whitey's Fish <laughs> Camp. <yeah. laughs> my balloon, my choice. Yeah, right, yeah. exactly. Yeah, all right, nailed it. Way to go, <laughs> Rave. My apologies. Uh, Get my right. laws off my balloon. The real yeah. Floridians are at Whitey's Fish Camp. <laughs> all right, zero to political. What's the next one? Another Gregory story. Did you know right. Beethoven? He may have. We're, we're still talking about how he died. Hey, really? <laughs> New testing finds lead, arsenic, mercury in his uh, like hair, hair follicle stuff. And they believe, uh, Greg, that's because he enjoyed drinking cheap red wine. Okay, Obviously, no lead was in that. a lot of pipes back then. And they ah. think that, that all that stuff leaches into the winemaking process. Okay. And they believe, yes. Inc- uh, cheap red wine? Yeah, very, very yeah. Yeah. He was getting franzia. <laughs> so how much was that back in the day? I know. Like half a cent? <laughs> half a shilling? How yeah. did he not have whatever? Beethoven money to get better stuff? <laughs> Apparently Traded Beethoven. for like a big like sack of feathers or something. <laughs> yeah, or didn't, a pelt. He, didn't he have dumb Beethoven money? Yeah. 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 <laughs> In fact, that was Beethoven's favorite drink. He drank a bottle a no, day or genius. more. All right. Believed it was good for his health, but something called lead sugar was added to sweeten Ugh. the taste. <laughs> oh boy. Dude, it sounds like Greg Gory's lifestyle <laughs> right, right there. Pretty much. Yeah. Although one bottle. Yeah. yeah. I mean, nice that's start. a nice start, oh, oh, Beethoven. Or more, or more. It is good for you. So the comments on this very odd but interesting oh, science story about cool. Beethoven, do they get political in more or less than two comments? Oh my God. Ugh. Once again. <laughs> All right. This is tough. To figure this one out. I'll say uh, I think maybe the third comment. I'll say it's the second comment, and I think it's going to be something about like how do we get some more of this cheap red uh, wine? How do we poison? Uh, yeah, uh, so on. Can we send a case of this to, to the White House, the, Trump the White House, camp, right. or yeah, the exactly. White House. Yeah. Perhaps somebody, uh, I like that, or perhaps yeah. Phil in the blank mm-hmm. has been drinking this red wine. Yeah, uh, right. red wine. Another ah. great thought. Any other thoughts? Menace, Sammy. It would. Uh, it would take a long while to figure out how. Yeah. Yeah. I think you See, that's where these people have I such think a you're talent. Right. Yeah, these people have right. a real talent for just like they see something and immediately they know how to make it political. I would where say, oh, I that? didn't know Beethoven was like a redneck Republican. There you like go. He was drinking cheap alcohol. So yeah. as far as to guess, more or less than two comments. Uh, I'll say less. Less. I'll say less. more. Less. More. 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 Split room. Third comment. Third comment. So there you go, guys. Really? All right. Yeah. All right. Yep. Yeah. And this one, oh boy, this is a stretch. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Dump, a.k.a. Trump. Dump posted on Highbrow Social, a.k.a. Sick Truth burn. Media. Yeah. So we've already, Sick we've already got, burn. We've got yeah, two yeah. jokes within like four words. Yeah, yeah good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, good stuff. <laughs> Dump posted on Highbrow Social. Never cared for Luddy. Beethoven. Dad. Had the moron stuck with KFC and Diet Coke. He might still be alive with perfect hearing. <laughs> okay. All right. Wow. Is yeah, that a real post? They had you, KFC did back he then. actually yeah. post that? No, 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 this is a joke yeah. from uh, someone on the so left. Okay. Yeah. This is from the left to the right yeah. this time. Uh, oh, he, they can continue. He might be self-spraying with disinfectant today. Not everyone can be stable like me. Oh, wow. okay. Got it. Wow. Yeah, see. Got it. Like from his point of view. That was like 16 jokes that were all bad. Wow. wow. Yeah. Awful. It's really good stuff. So I looked it up. Beethoven was making $100,000 a year in the 1800s. So wow. Wow. Rich. Oh, rich. Dude. Rich as hell. It's like making a trillion Damn, an hour. Son. Yeah. But you hear about so many of those artists <laughs> yeah. back in that era who would die penniless. Yeah. Not, yeah. Not, not, not old uh, Lundy Bond. Yeah. Not, yeah. not Beethoven. So, wow. Right, yeah, let's, do, uh, let's do one more. Zero to political. All right. This is another science story. This is about uh, boobies. Ooh, okay. 
That's what I'm saying. <laughs> nice. Now the nice. birds, unfortunately, guys. Oh man. You know those things, those little sea birds with the blue feet and the little pad the webbed feet. Yeah, right. yeah. You see them in nature documentaries. Well, it's a uh, it's a story about how these birds, like a lot of birds actually, if the first uh, egg hatches. And the second egg is maybe like a few days later and therefore smaller. Right. The bigger of these siblings will just kick that other bird out of the <laughs> oh, no. nest Bye. to die. Oh. And apparently the moms are like, yeah, okay, yeah. Bye, dick. That's the way of life. And they don't go, they don't go rescue that other they, little bird. Oh, just yeah. dies. God, this one seems easy. So this is, again, just a science story, though. And, you know, the harsh realities of nature. Uh-huh. Does it get political <laughs> in one. more or one less? Comment. <laughs> one comment. One. Yep. One. And it's, yeah. One. And it's going to be something along the lines of... Uh, you know, we don't do anything to help our own people. Uh, like, you know, we're, we're kicking people out just to be, you know, their own. It's their their own problems. You know, no no uh, no handouts. I mean, I think uh, like something like bringing the border into it. Really? I really? Think, oh, yeah, build I a think, wall. I think Take because those of, helpless fools back <laughs> over the wall. No, because of the name of the bird, it's gonna be something about Trump and Stormy Daniels or something. That's a good call. I okay. think it'll be. I wish Biden's older brother had done this when they were in the nest. Oh, oh man. okay. I'm, so I'm, I'm going one, one comment. Yeah, what was our first option? comment. What was our option? Two. Also two. Yes. Oh, yeah. Boy, higher, higher. All right, menace. I say less. Less, Sammy. More. More. It is less than two comments. Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> Bonus here. The first, second, and third comment are all political. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nice. nice. First comment, not a lot of joking going on here. just says, good Democrats. Okay. 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 Second comment, swinging back the other way. There are very fine boobies on all sides. Mm. Oh. Nice. All right. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 All right. We're going right. a little one. Okay. But why yeah, yeah. Right. point that out in an article about birds? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Third comment, and this one just, it's also from the right to the left. And I won't even, uh, to, to, be, to be kind, I won't even say. I've seen certain women, fill in the blank type of woman, Using their babies as weapons, hitting other women with them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> All right. He just threw it. He just <laughs> fill in the blank. Okay. You can fill in the blank with whichever side you want to hate. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Put a zero to political, you guys. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, fun stuff, you and know. Yeah, where were these writers when the Brady roast was being put together? Yeah. No. What right. the hell, guys? <laughs> you know, we forgot to uh, mention somebody, a big name, in yeah. today's birthdays. It's Vaughn's birthday. Hey, Vaughn. Yeah. Vaughn. Hey, Vaughn. Happy birthday, Vaughn. Our video producer, Vaughn. It is his birthday today. Yes. And of course, Menace bought a trio of cakes. Yeah, I Menage a cake. <laughs> I brought chocolate cake, yeah. carrot cake, and uh, some cake that says Happy Mother's Day. Right. <laughs> because hey. I yeah. figured like that'd be like the most freshest cake. That's probably like a uh, vanilla cake. Yeah, probably. And there's and a then, cute little butterfly on it. Yeah. True. Oh, there is. That's for Greg. That, isn't yeah, that that's for Greg. sweet? Yeah, you know how so kids good. will argue like, oh, I want a piece of the rose. Right. I get one of the roses. That's what we always fight over as kids. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I want the flower. Because there's extra oh, icing. Icing. Yeah. yeah. That's why I like the corner piece. Yeah. So much icing. So much icing. Oh, so yeah. Much. How old is Vaughn? I don't know. I was hey, thinking Vaughn, about coming that. coming in real quick. Yeah, I was like. Yeah. What I is don't the know. age of Vaughn? I think 35. Five? Really? Oh, he, he could be yeah, secretly forty-five. Think, All right, let's. 30, 30, he's, he's not in his forties. He could be twenty yeah, no, no, at the not, same time. He's not forty yet, or he's sixty. You know, because they say black don't crack. It don't crack. It don't crack. It don't crack. All right. Well, happy birthday. <laughs> happy Thank birthday. you. Thank um, you. Um, hmm. I think I'm, I'm going with I, thirty-five as well. I, I know he's told us before, yeah. obviously, but like yeah. you know, it's not something I think about every day. Well, hold on. <laughs> right. Um, uh, you said what? Thirty-five? Uh, no, I was joking. Uh thirty-one. I like it. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go 35. I'm gonna say yeah, 33. Too. 33. I like that too. I'm going way older. That like you look like you <laughs> yeah. would be like 30, really? maybe 31. No, I think he looks 27. Ah, oh, babe. Oh cool. yeah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, babe. Yeah. LFG to 27. LFG. Yeah. Sammy. Yes. 35 was my guess. 35. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. It's only because you know, but yes, I'm 35 years old. 30 years. Oh, yeah. wow. Okay, you're 35. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, 35 you're, years you're old. You look amazing for 35. Yeah, Thank you. Do. Appreciate that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Vaughn, any special plans for the birthday? Um, No, my mom got me a today? gift, though. Oh, <laughs> I want yeah? to share with you guys. <laughs> it's from your mom. It is the wildest shirt ever. Okay, it <laughs> says, yes, I'm a spoiled son, but not yours. I'm the property of a freaking awesome mom. <laughs> <laughs> She's a bit crazy and scares me sometimes, but it doesn't matter how old I become. I will always be her little boy. Oh, uh, <laughs> you hurt me. Yeah. The beast in her will awake 
and you will never find and they will never find your body. Wow. Yes, she bought me this shirt. <laughs> wow. That's cool. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a cool shirt. I like that. That's so nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that rules. Yeah. Well, happy birthday. Thank now, you, uh, you. which cake which do you cake think you're going to get yeah, into you first? Cuz oh. nobody's allowed to touch the cakes. Menace really needs you in here to get the piece of cake. I'm about to yeah. chow down right now on the chocolate one first. Oh, the chocolate yeah. one. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Absolutely. And then the Mother's Day cake cuz every few years I share my birthday with Mother's Day. So, oh, sure. you know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so it makes well. sense. There right. you go. All right. And yeah, again, <laughs> nobody's allowed to dip into the cakes until the birthday person does. Correct. So, yeah. All right. uh, if you wouldn't mind getting on that. I got you. <laughs> right now. Yeah, thank you. Happy birthday, Vaughn. If I was as thin as Vaughn, I'd eat the entire cake. I know. Why yeah. not? Why would why That's why not? he's not. <laughs> I know. All right. More Woody Shows next. The Woody Show.